think Tristan definitely wins for the longest link there. <laughs> That's it. No doubt. <laughs> Game over. <laughs> Bless him. Apparently he really wants the ribs for all those wonderful things he was saying. <laughs> sure. Well, thanks, Tristan. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, I feel like I have been taking it easy a little bit, actually, just going from the eddies to the lions. Bless him. He has been an absolute gentleman. <laughs> He did uh, did ask if I wanted to come up to the lines this afternoon. So uh, little cubs, well, not so little anymore, fighting over the buffalo. The one has gone back to sleep on the buffalo, by the looks of it. This one, we're not. It's just not entirely sure what's been spooking it, but yeah, that one. <laughs> I can think of better places to sleep. Because that, we did get a, a bit of a whiff, and uh, even though it has dried out a bit, there is still quite a, a, dis a distinctive smell to it. Let's put it that way. Okay, a little bit of growling again. Hopefully we'll pick that up. I'm absolutely amazed at that growl from this little eight-month-old cub. It's just incredible. There's quite a few flies that just came out of there, sure. <laughs> I'm just keeping quiet so you can actually hear that grumbling. It's really quite amazing. <laughs> Flies as a side course, Jeffa. <laughs> Entree. <laughs> but you will actually get some animals um, eating the maggots from carcasses, especially bush pig. Bush pig will, will come into a carcass that's pretty old, eating the, the leftovers if there is any after the scavengers have come through. Also eating any of the insects that are there. That's something we don't see much of is the bush pig around here. So yeah, I think maybe day three and that's going to be it. Hi Jackie. Jackie asking if it would have taken all the lionesses in the Unkahuma Pride to bring down this buffalo. And I've seen two lionesses bring down a buffalo. Certainly the one grabbed hold of the throat and then the second one lent the weight but the buffalo wasn't a big dugger boy like this so I just touched my hat there but, um, for some of the big buffalo you, maybe three or four females are needed to bring it down just depends on the individual as well I mean if it's a very weak individual then they won't need to overpower it as much as a strong individual so this was quite an old boy by the looks of it. I think Tristan had a good look at it during the day. And he called it, he did say that he thought the lions were following him, or following the small herd. And then they caught up with them later on after they moved from Gowrie down. Oh, 
<laughs> really? You're going to tell her your mum? <laughs> I'd like to see who win that fight. <laughs> Cheeky geeky miss. Yeah, I've yeah, I think I've gotten used to the bad smells over the years. <laughs> you learn to breathe through your mouth rather than your nose. Than your nose. I'll try and pronunciate. But that is the trick. And also trying to park upwind from it. 